Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more of The Binding of Isaac after birth. Um, so we've had two good runs in a row, which is pretty cool. Pretty unusual for me, actually. Uh, but that's fine. Let's do something different. Let's try a greed run. Um, and I want to maybe do... I don't know, there's still a lot of stuff I need to unlock. Like, I don't know, I, I don't really, like, I want to do... I want to unlock Lilith's Cambian Conception. It says I have it, but I don't actually have it unlocked yet, because I haven't... I don't think I've actually done it. Um, so to do that, we need to beat Isaac, I think it was. Let me go check real quick. Specifically what we need. Mmm, Cambian. Cambian Conception. Unlock this item by beating Blue Baby with Lilith. Okay. How do you get to Blue Baby again? Just want to make sure I know exactly where I'm going. Okay, the chest. After defeating Isaac while holding the Polaroid trinket, opening the golden chest in the middle will take you to the chest instead of displaying ending 12. Okay, so I have to get the Polaroid unlocked in order to beat Blue Baby. So I can't unlock Cambian Conception until I get the Polaroid. To get the Polaroid unlocked by completing the Cathedral six times, you may use the same character for all six completions. Okay, so we just have to keep on winning, apparently. Well, in that case, let's just do another... I mean, I'm, I apologize. I was going to... I'll just, just keep on playing with, with Isaac, but... That's my, my rationale, at least, is I want to I wanna work towards unlocking specific things. Um, butt bombs. Nope. Uh, Bob's reusable... or Bob's rotten head. It, maybe we can use this to some benefit here on a, on a... like a... just use it, you know? But then we'll go pick up the other item. Well, you know, I probably should have kept the D6, because there's still a chance I could recharge it on this floor. You never know. What do we got? The devil card. Okay, that's cool. Actually, yeah, I don't want this... It's, it's a good item. It's just that uh, the D6 has worked out so well for us that, uh, you know, I'd rather not. Oh, narrow dodge. That was a narrow dodge, too. He's gonna get me, I know it. These guys are nice. <clears throat> Second key. I know there's gonna be people who continue to say, like, you should play in hard mode. And I will soon. I don't know exactly when. From talking and, and listening to Northern Lion, like, the hard mode doesn't really change the game that much. You get more champions, fewer consumable drops, and you get um, more curses, more cursed rooms, cursed floors. But aside from that, like, I don't know, it doesn't change the game very much. It's still the same bosses. Let's go ahead and use this thing. Speed this one up a little bit. These guys are kind of tricksy. Regular old haunt. There's just kind of avoid the brimstone blast. If you stand directly in front of him, he usually brimstones. So you gotta avoid doing that. And of course, I should stand farther away so that I can actually dodge. And I dodged right into it. Nice work. It's fine, it's fine, as we've seen, um, getting hit doesn't usually, doesn't usually kill you. Can't even re-roll that damn item. Rats. Rats, rats, rats. We have an extra key, I just, I don't know, I'm just gonna go in here and see what we got. We've got, like, a battery thing. I'm gonna buy that. Never mind, I get head of pennies, penny tears. Uh, this is a chance to give me pennies on hitting things. That is not enough coins, though, to actually buy that. Guess we gotta go in here. And nothing but a troll bomb to just make me cry. Well! Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Is there anything else down here? I mean, I guess, like, maybe? Could I please have two pennies? Totally give me a penny. It's 
totally possible. I believe Penny Tears, like literally the only thing that it does, is gives you a chance to drop pennies on hitting an enemy. So potentially, we, we could get some money. I mean, that, that'd be nice. I think it's based on your luck stat. Also, it's a really cool looking tier effect. And sound effect when they hit. Maybe it's on killing a unit. <laughs> oh, this is bad. Oh, that knockback. Hey, our D6 is ready. Nice, a little bit of luck, that might make a difference. I love it when you hit yourself. It just makes my life so much easier. Why don't you teleport onto like the fire or something? Nice. Nice. Push the bombs to the sides of the map. That's what I'm starting to learn. Caffeine pill. Is it good enough? Let's see what's in here. Pentagram. I like the pentagram. Slight damage up. 1.69. Oh, I almost left. I did that without having any insulation, without any spirit hearts. I should have probably rerolled something. I guess we rerolled the item room. These red hearts are gonna, or red fires are gonna definitely get me. They're sneaky, you know? They wait until you're not paying attention and then they get you. See? I almost got hit. We have a bomb. No spirit, no, no tinted rocks. No tinted rocks. That could very easily be a secret room. I want my store. Sorry, my uh, my item room. Before we head down. Could use this pill. Is there anything that it could be that would benefit us? No, that was very clearly on hit. That was not on uh, death. Oh, you're a sneaky little guy. You shoot and jump. And you're on fire. So you're faster than normal. Yeah, that could very easily be a secret room. More luck. Cool. That was dumb. Why did she do a full spirit heart worth of damage? I'm assuming that's a she. I mean, if it's a he, it's, it's pink. It's a pink he. Huberty. Telepills. Now all we need is, like, money equals power. With these coins. That would give us a lot of damage already with 16. That would be a pretty good addition. We have an arcade. We should go in there. Got our money back. That's cool. We'll play this thing, because there's probably going to be some more. I'm willing to stay at a half... at one heart. One heart. I don't want to go lower than that. Okay, uh, this room... Can kill me. It's killed me before. Uh, sneak in there. Okay, we got PhD. PhD comes up a lot for me. Like, all the time. Um, would have been nice to have still had my pill, but yeah, I like PhD. What do we got? I can see forever. I can see forever. Some extra bombs. Um, okay. That was our store. We still need to get to the item room. Mom's wig. Hmm, no. <laughs> okay. This is starting to maybe get kind of interesting. I'm feeling a very money vibe from this run. Very, very much money. Uh, we also have full health. Why did we gain full health? I don't remember. Hmm. 
I don't really want to blow those up. We have I Can See Forever, so we need to find the other secret room. There she is. Just a plain old red chest with uh, a couple, three spiders in it. Alright, well, it's, it's alright. It's too bad we can't re-roll. Uh, blood Bank. Would have been nice. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that the recording was good. I had to look something up. Let me get some more shots in. I'm not actually hitting him at all. I should just get a little bit closer to this guy. Hey, full card, we could take advantage of this. The tower card. I'll just use it. Definitely some boss rooms that that, that could have been more useful on. What is that toe thing? It's two bombs to get it. We do have enough bombs, we could do it. Um Uh, sure. Okay, let's go get it. A lucky toe. More luck. Let's see if we can make it all the way across. No? No, no, no. Let's not be that risky. Why play- why, why be so risky, you know? So with Midas Touch, contact damage we do, we do damage equal to our coins, which right now is 18. Our shots do 5.19 damage, so we can do three times our normal damage just by running into an enemy, which is pretty good. Um, it'd be cool if we could get some sort of temporary uh, invulnerability so that we could actually use that without feeling like we're just suiciding our HP. Good thing that we just had that recharge because I would have picked that up accidentally. Oh, jeez. That is a tinted rock. We can probably shoot for that. We only have a 36% chance of a deal with the devil. Ah, oh, shoot the creep. Okay, some sort of another battery. I can never keep it straight what these batteries do, but for seven cents, I'm gonna buy it. Double charge, okay, that's the one that lets us have extra charges. And since we know pills are good, I'm gonna buy this pill. It's a range up pill. Range up. It's only 2.5 range, so it's not as good as uh, one of the other items, like, you know, if you get like mom's heels or mom's whatever. Those are like 5.2, I think. But still, it's more range, which is welcome. Allows me to, you know, get a little bit farther away and be a little bit safer. That was dumb. Yeah, no. Uh, okay. Pyromaniac. That's cool. I like Pyromaniac. Do you want to hold- maybe we should hold on to the Fool card. So we can try to get to Boss Rush. I don't feel like we're doing enough damage to actually get to Boss Rush, though. Like, I could get to it easily. I don't know, I could... Well, I don't know. Could I do it? Maybe I could do it. We'll probably find another card. I don't think we need to keep that one card for the next couple of floors. That's kind of crazy, isn't it? You are gonna run me down, aren't you? You're fairly fast, too. Not as fast as I am. Ah, uh, shoot. I should have gotten my charge. There's still a chance that we can actually um, get a deal with the devil. 36% chance, in fact. Mm. 
I need to remember that with Pyromaniac, I can heal myself with my bombs. So, blood banks. Blood banks are valuable. Pyromaniac. Since, yeah, Red Rage is fine with me. Um, what else did we want to do on this floor? Was there anything? I think we're good. I could go back for that battery, but I don't want to. <clears throat> Maybe we just do the boss right now. Uh, let's get a charge on our D6, and then we'll go do the boss. Use the Emperor card. Maybe we should save it for the next floor, actually. Next floor is going to be longer, which would arguably make the Emperor card more valuable. Uh, sure, we can come back to it. That is Unicorn Stump. That actually works really well. I think it allows us to do damage with uh, Midas Touched. Alright. Um, I'll tell you what, let's go test it. Oh yeah. This is going to work out just fine. So what I was thinking though is what if we use the D6 on the Emperor, or sorry, on the on the boss fight. Well, we don't. We just okay. We know that it's here. We're gonna be a wrecking ball. Can I turn this thing off now, please? Thank you. I should have taken these 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 guys out first. Would have been a lot faster that way. Um. Okay, so I don't need any of that. Key, maybe. There's <laughs> so much money! Oh, now all we need is like luck penny or something. You know, one of those like burnt penny or just any of the pennies. Oh, shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Negative 49.5% chance to deal the devil now. All because I took one hit. Rats. That was dumb. I was playing a little bit aggressive, considering that we don't actually have... getting so much money from this. Okay, um... <clears throat> I forget. Can I drop my unactive? And only drop the big toe. Okay. Okay, um... Well, I want to use the D6. I want to have the D6 charge available for the boss fight, but we're going to come back for Unicorn Stump for sure. That is sick. We have 99 cents already. We're so fast. We do have 11 bombs as well. Oh, and we can heal ourselves with our bombs. I keep forgetting that. Alright, if you do that again, I'm going to kill you. Do not get- do not take red heart damage on the boss fight. That would be bad. Because then we have absolutely zero chance of a deal with the devil. Hey, where are ya? Alright, this will be our last roll- re-roll with the d6, and then we're done with it. Almost pajamas, that's spirit hearts. Um, okay, that's- Okay, it's fine. Take experimental treatment, why not? So we picked up some damage, we lost some shot, like, speed. We have two movement speed right now, which is very fast. And we're done with the unit, we're done with that thing, we're just gonna... 
I go to our store. No, this is not a store. This is a. Uh, I don't have enough keys for that. Damn it. The real risk is, can I kill everything in the room before it runs out? With PhD, we're kind of obligated to go get that. We don't actually have to worry about taking any more damage on this floor. We've already done the boss. That was a dumb use of two spades. I thought it was the bomb one. Is there not an actual store on this map? We have the arcade. Puppy's head's cool. Well, it's a shame we don't get to use our money just yet. But I guess we're going to the next floor. See, the problem with this strategy is it's not going to work out super well for, like, the hush or something. Because you can't kill the hush fast enough. I don't care how much contact damage you have, it's it's not gonna be enough. But definitely we need something else. We need more items. Maybe maybe there was an item room and I just forgot. That I'd already been to it or something. <laughs> it's just so weird. Oh, sweet, mom's mom's range. Uh, contact from below. Um, I don't want any more items. I want spirit hearts. I want to find the store. And we're of course just leaving money everywhere because we're already at 99. There's no point in picking it up. We're low on keys and yet I'm picking up bombs. I don't know why. This is fun. This is nice having a money run. I just hope that we can do something with it. I mean, it's working out fine for, uh... Yeah, no. No, we're not doing that. It's working out alright. Let's just say that. The Midas Touch is getting a lot of contact damage because of all of our uh, money, but... No! Get over here. No, I need a key! Don't do this to me, game. Oh, no. Don't do this to me, game. Well, we've had two guppy items so far, right? Yeah, we have. Damn it! You serious? After all this, I'm not going to get a key. And I can't go to the store, and I've got all this money. I wasted my key. Here we go. Thank you. 
You know, that could actually be our third guppy item. It's not, but... I don't know why I'm hiding from the bomb blasts. They don't do any damage to us. Alright, let's go to the store first, so that if there is something we can spend money on, we can buy a key. Come on, offer me a key. Thank you. Spirit Heart, we'll take it. Um, jar Flies, I don't think we need that, because we've got Unicorn Stump, which is actually working out great. Um, we'll take this. Cool. Just checking out, looking for secret rooms. To go here. <laughs> That's funny, game. Uh, no, we're gonna reroll this thing as many times as we can. No, no, no. Mm, no. No. Uh, n no. I guess we have to take that one. Hopefully he does damage based on... Um, how do we get... No, oh, the left hand. Yeah, well, yeah, sure. Sure, Guppy, Guppy Dream would be cool. Do we want to try going in there? Okay, we've already been here. Not bad. We have PhD. Hematemesis gives us... Wait, were there two pills? There were two pills. Alright, okay. We're finally done with this floor. This floor took a little while, and we do need to pick up some money. But we're going to get plenty of money from killing bad guys, so... I'm not actually that worried about it. We could really use, like, a blood bank or something. I don't know. Get more HP from the, uh... Did I already do that? Great. We actually don't have a charge. Right now. Very nice. Ah, oh, shoot. I can't get through the poop. Should I shot the poop first? No! We're so slow, actually. It's 23 minutes. I think we're on the floor that lets us do boss... Uh, kill mom, though. I spent a little bit too much time in that last floor running around, trying to figure out exactly how this strategy was going to work. That doesn't even hurt me, so... Speed up! Range up! Emoth Tempesis. That is a stupid the draw. That's disappointing. Should we go in the curse room? I mean, there's a chance for a guppy item, so why not, right? Left hand's giving us tons of red chests. Might as well get up to 99 cents again so we do full damage. We'll wait till you guys are all off of the, uh... You know what I need now is I just need flying. It does do very weird things with music. With these. There's our blood bank. Obviously we need to donate as much as we can. And I grab a soda. If I remember correctly, it's like a 4% 4 chance per donation that it breaks. Something like that. Like, there's no doubt in my mind we're gonna gonna beat the crap out of uh, 
the normal bosses, but I don't think I can even do the hush, so I'm not gonna try it. Like, these items. We can't, we can't kill the hush quickly enough. Thank you, game. Yeah, because we... Because if there's one thing we need, it's more money. Uh, the lovers. The lovers. Oh, yes! Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, asking you shall receive! That's amazing. That is awesome. Come on. Get her. <laughs> it's like I've broken I've broken the sound in the game. The sound is all over the place with this unicorn stump. It's funny. Alright. Crimstone. We're hitting pretty hard with our money. Money shots. Alright, cool. Great thing about Unicorn Stump is you can use it every room. Normally, like, I think you actually have to have an item like this to actually make Unicorn Stump any good. Crap, I did it again. There's units that I can't hit. Loki. Four-way buddy, can you shoot? Can you kill those for me, please? Come on, and... Sure, why they're not dying right away. Game feels so weird without music. <laughs> Cube of meat! Guppy! More guppy! Let's go on. I think there's a store. What are we gonna do with the store, right? We don't need anything else. We're good. We got items. We got all the items we need. Um. I can't not open things, though. What's in here? Nothing I care about. Oh, forgot to try to press spacebar. Oh right, we're guppy, we can fly! I forgot about that. Ah, uh, it's awesome. So now we're a flying gold cat. With infinite money. We get so many spirit hearts, we're immune to bombs. I remember to press spacebar every room. Problem with Guppy, aside from the flight, it doesn't really benefit us very much. Because I, um... Because I, I can't actually, uh... First off, I can't think straight right now. And, uh, we've made it to the hush. With 13 seconds to spare. Um, do we try it? Let's try it. Why not, right? <laughs> oh, jeez. I only have two keys, so we can't really do as- Oh, red chests, cool. Forgot about that. Where are you gonna teleport me? Uh, should we take him? That's a lot of red heart. Let's just do it. We need to dig deep. Oh, what a waste. Guppy. We have five Guppy's items now. Paralysis. I thought we had PhD. Is that a different run? Lusty blood. Their blood brings rage. Okay, that's good. 
growing our hourglass. So I picked the wrong one there. Should have probably gone in there. Alright, whatever. Let's just see what happens. I should drop this pill before I forget that I have it and accidentally paralyze myself. Damn it, I just picked it up again. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna save Unicorn Stump probably for Hush. Nice thing is I I do have I am Guppy. So we do have flies. And once the unicorn stump rit wears off, we'll be able to do some pretty good damage with the flies, I hope. This may have been a horrible mistake, we'll see. Uh, let's just try it. Get him. This is so inefficient. It does nothing. It's doing nothing. Even with Cuban meat in there, it didn't do anything. It's like no damage at all, like maybe 10% of his HP. Alright, so the rest of it's going to rely on me dodging. This time we don't have the flashlight. But we are Guppy. So being Guppy is good. Are you going to... Hey, bro. Are you going to... Yeah. This may be a drawn-out hush fight. I'm sorry. It was a bad idea. I shouldn't have done this. But you gotta try, right? We do have a nice little suite of orbitals, so some of these shots are getting blocked. But you can feel the difference in DPS. Like, I can't do much. We should just ignore the flies and shoot at him. No, that's a bad idea, right? Letting him build up tons of units everywhere. We're down to one spirit heart. Well, this fun but interesting run's about to end, because even though I have 10 lives with a question mark, I don't think that we can actually beat him with 1 HP. I think I understand now what they mean about find one spot where you're safe. This is actually kind of working. It's these little red ones that are going to get me. Because I'm used to dodging the hushes shots. I like have a pretty good understanding of where they're going to come from. But all the red little blurb things, they just shoot random ones at you. Directly at you. And they're easy to miss. I'm going to just wait this one out. Are we safe here? I think we're safe here. Alright, I'm just going to wait here. I don't want to... I don't want to risk moving. Yeah, if you could go ahead and not do the continuum shots anymore, please. That would be great. Yeah, that was close. Oh, see, I don't like you. You're dangerous. Here comes some more continuum shots, or possibly the big, huge death shots. The death from the sky thing. I'm, I still don't hold any hope out that we're actually going to win. I think I'm going to die. I'm pretty sure. I can't keep up the dodging forever. There's so, so many. See, it's just too many damn shots. And I don't, I don't even really want to try, you know? I don't want to keep trying. I shouldn't have done this. It's a bad idea. I mean, beat the entire thing from start to finish now without any... No, I'm not going to do it. No. Oh, is there an easy way to just, like, forfeit? Like, I quit. <laughs> I just, I don't... It's going to take forever, and I don't want to... I don't want to do it. I mean, I could just, like... Um, this is going to turn into a loss, technically, isn't it? I think it counts as a loss. Even though I beat Mom's heart... It'd be nice if I could spawn with, like, more than just one HP. If I had five HP, I'd, I'd go for it. At least we can turn him into a gold little thing. There we go. Alright, cool. Well, that was an interesting run. I, I think we could have easily beaten everything except for Hush. So, it was a mistake to go try to do him. But we got pretty close, and, uh, we'll see. I don't know. 
I had fun. Hopefully you did too. I'll see you again in the next one. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.